Welcome to Module 2, Lesson 5. We're going to open your book to page 57. Our I can statement reads, I can write an addition equation to find the total number of objects in equal groups shown in other ways. So we're going to continue what we did in the previous lesson with addition equations for equal groups. We're starting with the Step It Out problem on page 57. The problem reads, Luis helps his mother make banana muffins. He puts the muffins in five rows. Each row has three muffins. How many muffins do they make? Letter A wants us to draw to show how Luis put the muffins in rows. I'm gonna draw my five rows. I'm gonna have to squeeze a little row on the top. Go ahead and show how many muffins are in each row. Your picture should look similar to this. You should have three muffins on each of those five rows. Now let's answer letter B. Write how many muffins are in each row. We have five rows of three muffins. Letter C asks us to write an addition equation to show how many muffins there are. Go ahead and complete this, showing the equal add-ins. We add that equal add-in to three, five times for each of those rows. I'm gonna go ahead and skip count by three. Three, six, nine, 12, 15. So how many muffins did they make? They made 15 muffins. Let's look at the step it out problem on page 58. Serena draws these triangles. How many triangles does she draw? First, count the number of rows of triangles. and write your answer. You should have found that there were five rows. For letter B, we're gonna find the number of triangles in each row. Count how many triangles are, on e are in each row. There are five triangles in each row. So we know that we have five rows of five triangles. Complete the addition equation to find the total. Our equal addend is five. And we have five groups of five. I can skip count to find how many total triangles. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25 total triangles. So go ahead and answer letter D. How many triangles are there? 25. And let's take a look at the last check understanding problem. Number one, Anna has some flower stickers. Find the number of rows of stickers and the number of stickers in each row. Then write an addition equation to find the total number of stickers. Here, you'll write the number of rows of stickers, the number of stickers in each row, your addition equation, and then your total number of stickers. Go ahead and solve now.
pause the video if you need any more time to solve. You should have found that there were two rows of stickers, three stickers in each row. So we know we have two groups of three stickers. Our equal add ends are three. Three plus three is equal to six. There are a total of six stickers.